Well, there's a uh, local museum that is transporting you into the life of a legendary artist with their latest exhibit. Good Day's own art enthusiast Big Al is live in Stockton this morning with the details. Big Al! Hey now, listen John, I'm telling you, I, I'm, I'm a silly man, but you know what? I love culture. I love that. And to see, I love going to art museums and seeing things, whether it's a day day or just going by myself, going with some friends, just to see other people in the honor of, you know, the passing of uh, Wayne Tebow and such. I, I did want to cover this. And oh, by the way, the second thing I wanted to tell you guys is pronounced Hagen Museum. Hagen as in ah. wagon. I was slapped in the back of the head by Susan over here. Like, no, it's, it's Hagen. Let me go over here and call by Hagen. But hey, listen, how are you doing this morning? I'm doing real well, and welcome to the Hagen Museum today. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. So listen, I'm trying to deal with the soreness in the back of my head, but we're talking about Frida Kahlo here. Yes. Yeah, so talk, tell us about Frida Kahlo. You know, most people consider Frida one of the um, most significant artists of the 20th century, and people are familiar with many of her self-portraits, um, but this is really about what motivated Frida, and I would almost consider it more of a history exhibit that is the catalyst for her art. That's fantastic. And there's a, there's a self-portrait of Frida right there. Uh, she really kind of fused in her heritage and also a lot of interactivity as well with her art. I mean, I was playing with a little art uh, thing a little bit earlier and uh, we talked about uh, here at the museum. This is pretty cool. She really believed in all of that. Yes, absolutely. And um, she um, got her inspiration from where she lived, her culture, her heritage, and her life experiences. And this is so fun for us to have an exhibit that's interactive and allows especially children to get a, a closer pulse and feel of the type of things that motivated Frida and hopefully motivates their own creativity. Absolutely. I, just, I was just like, this would be great for kids and great for families to come and just check it out and check out her her style and one of her yes. styles is hybridism. Uh, I think I'm not sure if I'm saying it correctly. You absolutely, you absolutely are. And this is an example of one of her works that utilized it. Um, and then we have an interactive for kids that are able to use magnets and put together uh, different animals and plants and do their oh, own form of like hybridism. This. Oh, yes, cool. yes. I'm this. Yeah. You can just actually move it around and. Yeah. Oh, nice, nice. And it is fun watching um, kids or even adults do this. Who are we kidding? And they're first cautious with more things that are, are similar, and then they get more creative yes, as it goes. Yes, yes, absolutely. So so obviously you guys do more than just Frida Kahlo, but there's yes, so many things here, three floors of museum space. This is fantastic. You utilize all of it. Yes, we absolutely do. We have two temporary exhibit galleries, which Frida is one of them, and it changes every six to eight weeks. And then we have a 19th and 20th century fine art collection and a Stockton San Joaquin history collection. Oh, yeah, because I noticed um, you guys have the butterflies and the hummingbirds, and there's actually a local artist who actually painted that uh, the Stockton artist who actually made that painting, and it goes around the circumference of the Frida Kahlo exhibit. Absolutely. Brando is a local muralist and artist, and we approached him early on after we had booked this exhibit um, because we like to um, not take away from an exhibit that comes, but to localize it. And so working with a local artist, and he did a lot of research, and symbolism was really important in Frida's artwork, and so uh, Brando did some um, research on some of her most used symbolic symbols um, and various kinds of flowers and specifically the butterflies you'll see used in a lot of her work and Brando did a fabulous job for well us. Well done, well done. Hey, this is an awesome exhibit. Make sure you bring your family. Hey, take your boo or take your bae out uh, on a date night and come out to the, the Hagen Whoa. Museum. Don't slap me in the back of the head. Don't slap me yet. Don't slap me yet. Hey, everything's on the website. GoodDaySacramento.com Come on and get educated. I don't want to get slapped. Back, back to you. Back well, to you. I got educated, too. I thought it was Hagen the whole time, and it's Hagen. Good to know. Hagen Learned. in Sacramento. We learned Hagen something. We did. We did.